So the good news is they only have two fire mages, but the bad news is is that they have two fire mages. I already see one casting Greater Pyro, and there's the other mage. That's a Frost Mage. Okay, so here's the plan. We find their healer, we use our cooldowns on him, and he flops over, hopefully, because there's a Demon Hunter on him as well. And if, like, if the healer doesn't die, then we just go on literally anyone else. I'm running a, like, a kind of weird build here. I'm running that one talent that gives you haste anytime you use Star Surge. Mainly because if you use it correctly, you have like 6% haste all the time. I think that's pretty strong, and a lot of people just underestimate it, so... That's why we're running that. And then obviously your haste increases the amount of times your Moonfire and Sunfire hit increases your cast time. It pretty much is like one of the most useful stats in the game, I'd say. And if you didn't know that, then I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised. Anyway, gonna go on this fire mage here. Should really just be focusing these guys after the healers, but that's alright. Okay. And we're actually playing Alliance too, because, you know, the horde queue times are still 15 minutes for losing. It's like half the time we lose a battleground anyway, but it looks like they'll win this one. Just my luck. Unless we go mid and just completely dominate these guys. Do you think there's a Zerking, though? Seems like we're just getting stomped too much to even try to go for it. Do some damage to this Feral Druid, because Feral Druids are super good right now. I like how they all got off of the node. Okay. Just keep dotting all of them, that's all I've got to do. Literally every single of those guys has all of my dots on them. And both of those do 2.5 thousand every 1.7 seconds. Which isn't bad. Reapply all my dots with my haste increase. And I think my dots do the increased damage. Like if I have my dots applied before I even get a haste increase, uh, their damage is still increased. So I don't actually have to reapply them, but it's just safe, I guess. The safer bet. Please let me bash this. Fuck, well that sucks, doesn't it? There goes some of my haste. We'll get that back up here. I don't even know what this talent's called. Star-Lord. It's like that... I, I'm pretty sure that's... That's a song. It has to be a song. Daft Punk song has to be... Probably like ten songs out there with that name. Unsurprisingly, Maldix, the one thing that kills the healer. Holy shit, we're four capping. Unexpected. Let's look at that talent. Here's my talents. Warrior Valoon times three because I like building up that instant astral power and I think it's really useful. Where are you going? Uh, renewal for the heal and I also use it in bear form even though I don't think it really makes a difference what form you use it in. Uh, Guardian Affinity, because whenever I go in bear form and use Renewal, I just follow it up with a Frenzied Regen, and that's... God, I'd want to say that's, uh, 55% of your health, yeah. Stun, Haste, pretty much you never go out of this town, and, uh, Shooting Stars, because who doesn't want Shooting Stars? Most Thorns ourselves. We also don't talk about Honor Talents. Holy shit, I'm fucking dead. Um... Yeah, that's nice. I love fire mages. I think... I don't know. Is there a healer around? I think there is. There's a resto shaman around, which pretty much means we're dead. We'll just regrowth ourselves. It's cool. Is that another one for me? Oh, thank god. God damn, that's really stupid. Need to try that on my fire mage. Because he had increased range from flame cannon there, and... If you don't take Flame Cannon as a Fire Mage, are you really a Fire Mage? We'll use cooldowns, because why not? Don't trap me, please. Gain that, like, 15% haste here or some shit like that. I don't know, it's a ridiculous amount. 15%, 9%, 24%, 50, 40% haste? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> and that's why I take the haste down. Because it gives me just, like, an extra 10% haste at all times. And Like, if you had a talent that just said... Hey, here's 10% haste that you could have, like, 70% of the time. Most of the time you take that talent. 
I guess right here I technically don't have it, but I build up to 6% so fast. And it really matters how well you manage your resources as well. And right now I'm not really doing the best. I'm probably just going to save all my astral power as I use Star Surge. Went back on my ward real fast. And then you'll notice here, I just don't have any resources to Star Surge with. And we're here alone. This is not a good spot to be in. As long as I don't get slowed, we're okay. Rasto Druid, Mess Tweaver, Rat Fire. All just horrible people to be in this team fight. Like, all those classes were just flavor of the month classes right now. I would wish I could say flavor of the month, but like, the meta doesn't change a depressing... Like, the amount of time Blizzard has to change shit and chooses not to is really depressing at this point. Another reason, or another thing I can bitch about on retail. The fact that it takes two months for a fucking hotfix to go out for PvE trinkets. Which don't even get me started. Which, because I can't, because I don't arena, because that's just how bad PvE trinkets are right now. Kill the healer, I'm trying, I'm doing my best. <laughs> I'm literally the only person doing damage here, in this battleground. And then there's just the fucking fire mage, that just throws out 35% of your max health gone instantly every goddamn second. But there is a berserking. There might be some good out of this. Never mind, we are, we're fucked. And that's why I take that talent. Slowly cat form up here. I also don't know if cat form actually increases your uh, movement speed in vanilla. I'd want to say it does, just from memory. But I have zero fucking clue. You're also j like you're also trusting the memory of a seven-year-old, fifteen years ago, whatever that was. Quick math, I don't know. I'm just gonna stun this guy and just run away. Oh, whoops, that's not <laughs> that's not what I wanted to do. Maybe one of these days we'll do a no-HUD battleground, but today's not that day. Who's cleansing? Okay. Yeah, there's two healers here. I forgot about that one. You think Mistweaver or Druid's worse to deal with? Mistweaver's Oom now, so it doesn't really matter. Guess we just go on the Druid. Mistweaver can't do diddly shit now. But he still gets a Nord shout. There we go. That's what I'm talking about, team. Aw, oh, hell yeah. People sometimes ask me, man, why don't you play Feral? And then I just look at them and I'm like, why would I skip out on two instant cast 20,000s? Because that's just what happens. That's what Star Surge is. It's fucking ridiculous. Let's see. I've used it um, 53 times. Every time it's hit for 17,000, which is the same as a Ferocious Spite, pretty much. Unless, I don't know, I've heard people getting like 50,000. So Ferocious Spite can hit a lot harder, but Star Surge is up so much more often. And I just hate Feral. No one likes Feral anymore. At least I don't. I guess we're going Lava. Uh, did we fucking win? Hello? <laughs> What's happening? Okay, so here's the team fight that I probably don't want to be in, actually. Am I in boom conform? Holy shit, I am. Doesn't look like it whatsoever. Probably because I'm a fat human. No matter what. If I'm playing a game, why would I why would I play a fat human in, in game when I'm one in real life? Doesn't really make sense, Blizzard. It's the real reason I'm not playing Alliance. God, your poor health. Fuck, he's so low. Okay. Well, GG. Let's see if we live here. Looks like he's not hitting us anymore, so that's cool. Gain that haste. I'm gonna check my haste here again. Yeah, it's just 46% when I have two Star Lords up with that cooldown. Which is really ridiculous. Like, if that's just not machine gun boomy, I don't know what is. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, description, bell thing. I'll see you guys next time.